Hi, welcome to Gabe's Cave. I'm Gabe. And I'm Darren. And guess what we're doing today? That's right, we're finally showing off the new shop and studio. I know a lot of people have been looking forward to this lately, and we're here. We're finally done. Tomorrow is the big day. Um, I, I, hope in, I hope everybody enjoys it as much as we do. Uh, we'll go right into it because we don't want to waste a whole lot of people's time here, especially mine and Gabe's and everybody else here because it's late, and we really have a big day tomorrow. So there are going to be people here, just like Gabe said, but you probably didn't hear Gabe. Anyways, uh, we're really excited about the whole shop and our little town. Hope they enjoy it. Um, the main room here, when you first walk in, we have some cool stuff in here, uh, but that's not what this video is about. This video is about just showing you everything. We have a really cool Yoda here. I don't know where they found it at. It's super sick, though. Look at him. It's life-size. You could, like, pick him up and carry him around. He's bigger than Grogu is. Can Canton. They got it from Canton, Texas. For those that don't know, Google Canton, Texas. It's crazy. Very crazy. But if we go on along down this way here into the next room over... We have the room I hope everybody in town enjoys and is excited about. That is the comic room. This is a comic shop. Um, you know, what, without this room, I don't think there would really be anything. This wouldn't really be, it would be a toy store. It wouldn't be really a hobby or comics, cards, and collectibles. Um, we plan on having all the goods for everybody in town and around. And if you, you need some comics, I suppose, hit us up. But that's not the point. There's some familiar faces in this room here. You know, we've got the Silver Surfer, Shiny. which is <clears throat> he's been a part of our our journey for a long time here. Shiny man and he is making a really, really good uh, stand, for centerpiece and stand for pops. And his noggin glows quite well under that light. However, he did fit in this one. He did not fit in the other one. They had to, like, lower him down. And, uh, yeah, whatnot. If we just move right on along, you know, seeing as tomorrow, the big opening weekend, we do have some artists in the house. Um, that's one of the big points of the opening. We got William Russell over here. He's no longer the angry artist. He's the happy artist. Um, we have Damon Pelican and Rob Broussard as well. All good friends of ours. And uh, we'll be here tomorrow, which hopefully today, I guess, whenever you're watching the show. Um, and if you're watching it three weeks from now, just enjoy the video of the shop tour. They are long gone, but you can definitely hit them up, and we'll probably have their stuff down below. They're great guys, great friends of ours, and Damon made his shirt. Check that out. Hello. Oh, I'm in your way. But this room is actually going to be used as the game room. This is going to be Gabe's Cave's game room. We'll have three to four tables in here. We'll have D&D &D stuff. We'll have all kinds of, you know, you want to play Magic, you want to come out and you want to play Pokemon, you want to have tournaments, whatever the case, we have D&D &D stuff here. Um, this will be our game room for the shop. We hope everybody enjoys it. Um, I'm definitely going to have to learn how to play some D&D &D myself. I do play Magic a little bit. We'll see how that goes, though. But if we go on back through here... We go on back through here to the other side of the building. We'll have, uh, you know, the main counter here, which is honestly my favorite piece. I really enjoyed stacking these these uh, these dice up, and then we'll have the really cool centerpiece here with whatever we want to put in it. Probably something random every week you come in, and a cool little bit of uh, drink and snack station here. Now we go on to another bit here called the artist lounge. This is where if you've got a whole bunch of people in, we've got a big weekend, we have a bunch of artists in, they can come in here and hang out, relax, hang out here and just, you know, have a snack, have a drink, whatever, watch some TV. Surprise, Gabe's not in here sleeping right now. We got an arcade machine over here. This is... Uh... <laughs> we do have Brandon right now relaxing. Uh, he is hanging out after getting the shop all ready, and what an odd way to pour your Dr. Pepper, Brandon. <laughs> and now, 
the uh, the last room, well, not really the last room, but the last room that's really important on the show and in the building. This is the studio. This is where we have been recording. This is where we have been doing all of our shows lately. And what we were really amped up to uh, and, and excited about doing, uh, or jumping from one building to another. This is the this is the new studio. Hopefully everybody enjoys this bit here because uh, it's definitely a... <laughs> Gabe, you good, buddy? Okay, all right, well. Um, we have this new awesome desk. This is a, a, this big boomerang newscaster desk. This was actually a gift from a, a friend of ours who is a master uh, woodworker. Really awesome desk. We want to say thank you, Paul, for that. We have our, our shelves here. Uh, this, you know, Uncle Nasty, Brandon, Gabe, and I all have a shelf. We've... Uh, our mom has a shelf, and then our dad has a shelf up there on the top as well, which is Marty Drill Pool. As everybody knows, we have all of our statues here. We've swapped out Red Sun uh, with Venom. We just have some random knickknacks here, Brandon's posters that you probably never saw in the other one with some autographs. We've got some original art. Uh, I've got a little corner over here that nobody has seen yet. Well, actually, if I can make my way around here without getting tangled up and falling, I'd be bad. We have a little corner over here that has not been used yet on the show, and it will be soon when we figure out the uh, logistics of it, I suppose. I don't really know. Uh, this is where we're actually going to do the Lego builds and other builds, statue builds, Lego builds. Uh, we'd hate to scuff up our big boomerang table, and the builds are, you, you kind of feel so far away with it. So we're going to have another camera up here, and we're going to have a camera back there, and we'll do our builds here. Uh, probably Gabe and I. It's going to be so, nifty. Yeah, it's going to be nifty, like you said. And this is going to be, I suppose this is more of like my corner. This is all my art uh, that I've personally purchased in, in what? Oh, Gabe's is back in the corner. I did buy that, though. I'm just saying. Um, but, yeah. Hopefully everybody enjoys our uh, little bit of a tour here uh, of the, the shop. And those that are not uh, local and those that can't show up, we hope you enjoy it. Hope and you enjoyed the B-roll of me napping. Yeah, Gabe napping. And, um I suppose we should go on to a, another segment that everybody knows and loves, and that's where we give some stuff away. Now our everybody's favorite part of the show where we give stuff away. Seth Grove's work this week. Brandon, why don't you run a winner's video? Run it. And we would uh we would be displaying Seth's uh, three cards here, but it is after the deadline when we're filming this, so that means we already ran the video. Obviously, it's right here, and they're already packed up, so we know who the winners are because we're filming in advance. You'll know when this goes live tomorrow on opening day, and they should already be in the mail. Let's just say that. I mean, you should have them by mid next week, as long as you're not out of the country, because I didn't actually look. Allison knows. But as long as you're not out of the country, you should have So one. irresponsible. Yeah, I know. Right, right, right. Well, now on to this week's artist. And that is Jay Manchan. And we have some awesome stuff here left over. We're going to be giving away five of these. This is the second run and the last run of his. We're going to do five here. And everybody knows that we throw these... We throw the extras in loot boxes randomly, so everybody gets a. I mean, you, you, he, all his stuff gets given away at some point or another. But we're going to go ahead and do the, the you know five for his second run here. Uh, Gabe, why don't you name them off so everybody knows, uh, kind of what we're dealing with here? We got Hondo Onaka, Bubble Buddy. Uh, I have no idea. That is the pink Starship Trooper. We got. That's right, Brandon. Uh, William Captain, Sh Captain William Shatner. Captain. That's William Shatner. All right, uh, Cacodemon from Doom. 
Flower Face and uh I don't I don't know Grandma Rodan. Well, I mean it to me, I, I get the old uh Shin Godzilla look. Oh uh, yeah, Shin Godzilla. Yeah, yeah. yeah, that's who it is for sure. Mm-hmm. Uh in reality in reality I think we got E. T. Uh I don't is that a gremlin? I think. Is that no, a gremlin, Brandon? No, you see the bubble, it's bubble buddy. Oh gotcha. I have no idea. <laughs> Pink Power Ranger. I mean, I'll be honest with you. I know that's William Shatner, but I don't know what movie's from. M- Michael Myers. Michael Myers, that's Halloween. I thought Michael Myers confused. was the guy who played Cat in the Hat. It is. Not to be confused with Mike Myers. <laughs> <laughs> Do we have the same person here? Yeah, sure. Okay, all right. Well, anyways. Whatever. <laughs> Jay, we love your artwork. Yeah, you are fantastic, and we're looking forward to uh, future sets. And the way that you can win one of these cards, super simple, super easy. Like the video, leave a comment, subscribe, all of the above, and hit that first link in the description below, gabescave.com forward slash giveaways. Just fill it out. Make sure you look it over before you hit submit. And give us your favorite, your you know, your top five that you like here. And if you win one, we'll make sure to send you which one, uh, which one you liked in the, you know, one to five. Super simple. It's all free. Free, 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 free. And uh, all we like to do is just give stuff away and have fun on YouTube. So, uh, you know, Gabe, how do you feel about the new uh, the new shop? It's nice. Brandon, how do you feel about it? Any, some final thoughts here? It's great. Wow, you guys are really just... Do you want so, me to be enthusiastic? Sorry, I'm, sorry, I'm just hungry. Do you want me to be enthusiastic? I Brandon wants a sandwich. <laughs> Woo! Yeah, I think it's uh, awesome. I think the lights behind us just flashed a little bit. I uh, do think it's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> You're welcome, Chris. <laughs> I think um, <laughs> it's pretty exciting having a shot. Finally, Gabe is not real enthusiastic on camera or in... in uh, when you meet him in person, but he he is excited about it. I believe it's gonna be a, a cool place to hang out. Look. We're gonna have a a lot of a lot of cool things. We're gonna have you know the game room for people to come in and play games. We're gonna have the artist lounge. And we're gonna have regularly have artists come in and whatnot. And um, the the lounge and just everything. The atmosphere I think is really cool. It's a more down to earth shop, and we can you know order, hang out, whatever, anything. Uh, and we have another room, too, we didn't show off, called the Maturing Room, and that's where the backstock type of thing is. And we have a pretty cool uh, art board back there. The uh, the three artists in right now, so William Russell, Damon Pelican, Damon Pelican, and uh, Rob Broussard are all back there drawing on it. So we may get a couple shots of that um, when they're done, if they're done in time with editing. Um, if not, then you'll see it on an Instagram post, I'm sure, in the future. Other than that, you know, it's been a fun episode. We hope everybody enjoyed the the walkthrough and my very quick like and hopefully it didn't sound too much like an infomercial hope you liked my nap that wasn't really it wasn't supposed to be i was just really wanting to show it to everybody that's uh, you know in the uk and the rest of the world that has been looking forward to it since we've moved from the office building we were in before to the clubhouse where we were in the lounge of the clubhouse set up with our Comic-Con. convention our comic-con uh, booth, which is funny because between episodes we were literally going to show, so we had to reset it back up every time. And mm-hmm. now we're permanent, and we need to get something behind us. Is the only real next thing here. The shop and the, the everything is done. Besides something else going right here behind to lighten it up a little bit. That's uh, that's the next step in finishing the building thing. Yeah, Brandon, you have anything else to say about it? Hey, Gabe, can I, can I get some of your tots? No. Give me some of your tots. No, they're mine. <gasps> Get your own time. No. Gross. Uh, Freaking idiot. Yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed Darren's shenanigans, Brandon's bartending, and my nap. Yeah. Well, we'll see you on the next one. Uh, we have a really cool episode up next week. A really cool interview for those that like anime, and we hope you enjoy it and enjoy this one. And until next time, friend. Bye.